chemical properties of hydrogen peroxide so hydrogen peroxide acts as oxidizing agent and reducing agent in both basic and acidic medium oxidizing agent and reducing agent in both acidic and basic medium Okay. So, first case oxidizing action in acidic medium. Oxidizing action in acidic medium. Take one example 2 Fe2 plus iron. Fe2 plus ion present in the solution. Okay, X plus 2H plus acidic solution. Okay, plus H2. Okay, so Fe2 plus is oxidized. It's the oxidizing action of H2O2. So H2O2 oxidizes Fe2 plus to Fe3 plus. Oxidation takes place. Plus 2H2. Next, second case reducing action in acidic medium. Reducing action in acidic medium. Okay. So, 2MnO4 minus manganate ion. In acidic solution plus 5H2O2. Okay, this H2O2 reduces MnO4 minus 2 Mn2 plus. Here plus 7, so it gets converted into 2 plus. So reduction takes place. Okay, 2 Mn2 plus plus 8H2 plus 5O2. Next, third case, oxidizing action in basic medium. Oxidizing action in basic medium. In this case, example, 2Fe2 plus plus H2O2, presence of H2O2. It gets oxidized. The reaction takes place in basic medium. So, Fe3 plus plus 2OH minus. So, reaction takes place in basic medium. Now, next case. Reducing action in acidic, sorry, basic medium. Okay. Reducing action in basic medium. Example I2. I2 plus H2O2. Hydrogen peroxide uh, reduces I2 to I minus ion. In the in, in basic medium, reaction takes place. Plus this gives 2 I minus. Reduction takes place from 0 to minus 1. Okay. Plus 2 H2O plus O2. Okay, so in our, from all these cases, we can see that uh, this hydrogen peroxide acts both as an oxidizing agent and reducing agent in uh, both acidic and basic medium. Now, let us take few more examples. So, reactions in which hydrogen peroxide acts as an oxidizing agent. Example. 2Ki plus H2O2. Okay. H2O2 acts as an oxidizing agent and gives 2KOH plus I2. Okay. Another example Hg plus H2O2. Hg, mercury. In presence of 
H2SO4 sulfuric acid reaction takes place and form HGO plus H2. So, here H2O2 acts as a oxidizing agent. Okay. Now, next case H2O2 acts as a reducing agent. Reducing agent. Take few examples. H2O2 with ozone, H2O2, O3. Here, H2O2 acts as a reducing agent and form H2O2, H2O plus 2O2. Oxygen gas is liberated. Next, another example. With chlorine gas, here also it acts as a reducing agent. Gives 2HCl plus O2. These are the few examples in which H2O2 acts as oxidizing agent and reducing agent. So, next important prop, uh, chemical properties. Second property, acidic property. So, H2O2 is a weak acid and it has two ionizable hydrogen atoms. Okay two ionizable hydrogen atoms okay next decomposition decomposition of h2o2 2h2o2 gives 2h2o plus o2 o2 gas is liberated okay and this H2O2 is an unstable liquid. Next, third case addition reaction. Addition reaction. It is capable of adding itself to double bond. Okay, that is CH2 double bond CH2 plus H2O2. Ethene. CH2OH and CH2OH. Yeah. The product obtained ethane 1, 2 diol is obtained. So, addition reaction takes place. Next, next important property H2O2 is a good bleaching agent. Good bleaching agent. It is a good bleaching agent for uh, delicate materials like ivory, silk, wool etc. And the reaction will be like this H2O2 gets converted into H2O plus oxygen. This is nascent oxygen. Due to this nascent oxygen, the bleaching action takes place. Okay? This nascent oxygen combines with colouring matter and which in turn gets oxidized. Due to this oxidation, the bleaching action takes place. Okay, So, it acts as a good bleaching agent. These are the important chemical properties of hydrogen peroxide.